I've got to make a quick run to the grocery store and then it's uh, back home to work on a video. Good morning, YouTube. This is Cruise Man in Carrollton, Texas. It's about uh, just about six o'clock in the morning, and it's uh, Saturday morning, so I'm doing my morning ritual. I'm on my way over to Einstein's Bagels to have my morning coffee and food bar. I eat a Atkins food bar every day. Except on Sunday. On Sunday, I allow myself to have a bagel. I do love them, and I've, I've ate too many of them. I, I've always struggled with my weight, so I have to really uh, watch what I eat very carefully. So it's still dark out, and uh, usually I do this at about 5 o'clock in the morning or a little earlier because uh, they open earlier during the week, but on Saturday and Sunday, they don't open until six o'clock so I sleep in another 30 minutes or so and get a little work done before I head out so I will be there in about takes me about 10 minutes to get to the one I go to on Saturday there's actually two Einstein Brothers bagels uh, within I'd say 10 or 15 minutes of where I live so I go to one during the week and I go to a different one on the weekends and it's a long story as to why I do it that way. So I'm going to go have my coffee. Just kind of showing you my daily routine today. Got a few things I want to talk to you about, catch up on. I'm trying out my new GoPro Hero 7 Black, which is mounted on the handlebar. And we're going to give that a try today. Wanted to see how it performed in low light conditions, so I thought I'd give this a try. And we'll talk more about the GoPro Hero 7 Black. When the light sun comes up and we get a little more light going, and I'll have a chance to uh, update you on all the new stuff going on at Cruise Man's Garage. Well, I've had my morning coffee. The sun is up gonna be a hot one today it's already 85 degrees and it's only 745 so it's gonna be pretty warm today I think it's gonna get up in the high 90s I've got to make a quick run to the grocery store and then it's uh, back home to work on a video done at the grocery store and I'm ready to head back home and we'll uh, pick it up from there so let's go Do you remember our first touch? When I look at you now and the adrenaline rush So 
Well, I'm heading back home after uh, stopping off at the grocery store. And since the last time I did a motor vlog, I put out a couple new videos on the website. One of them, and the most important one, I think, is the where I review the accessories that I've added to my 2018 Goldwing. Now, some of you wasted no time in pointing out that there's a few things I left off the list. I still have uh, a few accessories and add-ons that I have yet to review. And the reason is because I was kind of running out of time shooting the video because a uh, true green truck pulled up across the street and I knew they were getting ready to fire up those pumps to spray their uh, whatever they spray and the noise was going to be kind of uh, going to interfere with my wonderful audio quality. If you watch that video, you already know I've been struggling with the autofocus on this Panasonic camera. So I may be uh, in the market for a new camera soon. Which brings me to the subject of this new GoPro Hero 7 Black. I have it mounted on the handlebar right now so all you're getting is the view of me from that camera and I would be using it to replace this camera except there's no way to hook up a external microphone to it yet they do make an adapter which is rather clunky and even those are not available right now I don't know why GoPro made it so difficult to add an external microphone to this camera, but they did. So for now, I'll probably be using the uh, Hero 7 Black just for uh, shots of me or maybe placing it other places on the motorcycle. Now, I'm not using all the capabilities of this GoPro because it will shoot uh, pretty uh, good video in 4K. And I'm not using the 4K features yet because it takes a long time to edit video in 4K. And I'm not sure it really, the advantages outweigh the disadvantages because it takes about three times longer to render a video in 4K uh, than it does in 1080p, which is what I tend to use all the time. in the Nashville area, let me know in the comments down below. Now it looks like I'll only be spending a couple of days in Nashville because we're extremely busy this time of year. And so it's possible that I will only be at the trade show on the 28th. I will be at the opening ceremony on the 27th to pick up our packet. And I should be at the trade show the morning of the 28th just so you'll know now I don't that's not that can change but right now that's kind of the plan if you're gonna be in Nashville at wing ding 41 please let me know in the comments down below. And if you like this video and you want to see more of them, make sure you click that little subscribe button. And if you click the little bell icon, you may get notified. I don't know how it works anymore. I uh, used to get notifications from YouTube when we come out with new videos. I think there's a good chance you'll get notifications, but I don't know if it's guaranteed. 
but if you subscribe and you look in your subscribe tab on your YouTube channel you will see our new videos as they are posted and we've been posting quite a few videos lately So that's all for now. Until the next Cruise Man's Motor Vlog. Thanks for joining us today.